And let's check the. Okay. Well, actually, I want to show. Them. You wanted to show the eighty-three. The eighty-three. Look at this. Okay. Look how far it went. Keeps going. Keeps going. Oh my goodness. Yeah, we're close to. It's really almost eighty-five. <laughs> it's insane. And then you wanted to explain cross threading to me. All right, cross threading, which is very important when you put these in. All right, so this one was under eighty. It's funny, one was real bad, and yet the, so far the rest aren't as bad as this one. Okay. All right, so cross thread. So basically, what happens is you have threads, all right? Okay. Then, you, then you have your cylinder head, okay? Yeah. What happens sometimes is you could be off on an angle like this, mm. and you start turning, and all of a sudden, it starts destroying the threads. And you think you're doing okay, right? And all of a sudden, you start to keep turning. And matter of fact, it, it starts to stop, and you start forcing it even more. All of a sudden, you pull it out even, you know, you go to pull it out, right? And then you see all the aluminum on here, because it pulled Ooh. the thread in out of the <laughs> aluminum heads. Okay. So that's why it's that. very important to keep it as straight, when you put them in, straight as possible, and hand start them. Got it. Because when you're hand starting them, right? If you do cross thread like this, right, you're gonna feel it, and you can you can't really do nothing with your hand. But if you just do it with your wrench, well, guess what? You can you can cross thread it one, two, three. I'm not even realizing. Now all of a sudden you're like, wait a minute, that didn't go down all the way. Now all of a sudden you start taking it out, and then you can't even get it started anymore because the threads, the upper threads, are all messed up. So that's what they call cross threading, and to avoid it, I can't stress enough, start with your hands. And God forbid that happens, then what? Then you oh, go into God. the mechanic. Then you're gonna. You got to retap them sometimes, which is not easy, and it could be dangerous to the cylinder. Oh, uh, so yeah. big, big problem. And then you can so. put. Uh, they have a, uh, a thread chaser, I think they call it. All right. You know, another piece you can put back in. You just don't want to go that way. Got it. You really okay. don't want to. Okay, but so anyway. this one's out, and now it's the same sort of replacement. Now I'm back to normal replacements. I'm gonna put okay. this one in. Um, and then, okay. And then you can come back out. Uh, okay.